Hello, today we're going to walk you through the simple steps to assembling your Pleasant Bay 5-foot slat back bench. After you've carefully unpacked and taken an inventory of your hardware and parts, it's time to move on to step 1, which is a two-part step, assembling part A, the left arm, and part B, the right arm, to parts D and E, the frame, and two supports. For this, you'll need your number two Allen key and your number one seven by 90 millimeter screws, all eight. Start by taking part B, making sure to line up the slots with the inserts on part D, being careful to line those up, insert. Take your screw, your number one screw, hand tighten, Once you've hand secured, finish with your number two Allen key. Once you've finished securing the screws, it's time to move on to the second part of step one, which is securing part A to part D. Again, making sure that those slots are facing in. Line them up with the inserts on part D, taking two of your number one screws and secure. It's important to note that when finishing step one, make sure to leave one side a little loose so that you can insert part E. So with two screws in hand, make sure that you have the attachment facing down and to the front. Line up the slots with the inserts. Hand secure. Finish with the Allen wrench, being sure to make one side a little loose. Once that's finished, repeat the same process with the second part E, being sure to face the connector down and toward the inside of the bench. Lining up the slots with the inserts. Once all eight are secured, it's time to move on to steps two and three, attaching the frame to the seat, or part C. Making sure the connection rails are facing down the slats on top, you'll need all four of your four by 30 millimeter screws, or number three screws. Simply slide into place. Align the slat support bars with the pre-existing holes. Insert the screw and use your not included Phillips head screwdriver to finish all four screws. When all four are tightened, all that's left to do is enjoy.